Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Republican Revolution. So we have kinsmen that want to beat things. We should have plenty of nice stewards, which is excellent, because we've been breeding them into the family. My nephew. Um, let's find out where the Clavelli household is. Yes, it's in our capital. Should always be in our capital, really. Let's collect taxes there. We're going to appoint... Sure... This guy actually has our... No, this guy. Yeah, I'm gonna go here. Our spy master is actually not too happy with us. Due to short reign title claimant. Um, why are you a title claimant? You're a bishop. Why do you have a claim on that? Okay. Well, it doesn't seem like he's gonna be too problematic. We could just change it up for our cousin, though. Although he's possessed, so he might get us killed. Let's give him a chance. Give him a chance, man. Alright, we're over our domain limit. Um, I am Count Leopoldo of Veglia. I'm a Midas touch with 22 stewardship. My wife is possessed. What's with all these possessed characters, I wonder? Um, can we kill my wife? Yes, we can. She's just not quite good enough. Nope, nope, never mind. She is. That just hasn't updated yet. I don't understand why they haven't fixed that. Yep. As long as we can hold on to all of her holdings, we'll keep our wife around. Although she's 42, so she's not making babies. We need to get rid of her. I mean, she could make babies for three more years, but she's probably not going to. We're not going to give her a chance. Kill the woman. I have a kinswoman that needs an educator. Let's give her to a spy master type person. And a kinsman. Let's make him into a... That thing. We should invest in technology. I think we won't, actually. I think we'll hold on to our points until we have control of Venice again. And we need an ambition. Become the king of Croatia. Improve diplomacy. Become exalted among men. I think we want to become exalted among men. We do have a few bishops. And we did retain hold all of our cities. So we have control of one of the, the city that we built here. We have control of a city here, here, here. And down here. This city is actually still controlled by... Uh, wait a minute. Which which city was it that... Ah, here. This one is controlled by... Apparently it's actually directly underneath Serene Doge. Serene Doge. I don't know why. I, it's still... Dang it, I just did it backwards. Serene. It is Serene Doge. Okay, okay, okay. Calm down. Let's, uh... Go on a pilgrimage. The good thing about dying is we have lots of money. But we're over our trade post limits, so we are not at. Ah, I can't talk. Uh, we'll go to Jerusalem. So we have lots of money, but we uh, we can't actually do anything really with it. Uh, the Tribuno family is not doing well, to the detriment of the Republic as a whole. As such, I consider it my duty as Serene Doge to get them back on their feet. Regret regretfully, this means granting them a few of your many trade posts. <laughs> okay. So Patrician, Dia, D, Patrician of D. Chiramonti is saying, Okay, well, we're just going to give some of your trade posts away. I'm sure you understand the necessity of these measures. This is outrageous. Um, you have no choice but to grant his request. Patrician Prospero seizes Constantinople. So he would take those three over there. Or I can say, I think not. I can easily prove that the trade posts will do far better under my continued rule. Or let's not be hasty, my dear Demetrio. Because of my high intrigue. It's actually not even that high, really. I can, uh, I think we'll use the stewardship one. So no, we're not giving away any of our trade posts. Instead, we're going to attack House Corsini. Corsini? Orsini. I believe we can just attack him, can't we? No. Damn. Damn. I thought that we were... Allow maybe maybe we do have to have fewer trade posts than they do. Oh god. Our regent is terrible. Normal feudal levies. 
Sure. I think we should just stop and repair it. Yeah, I'll just pay for it whenever. Uh, once again, no. In my continuing efforts to safeguard the security of the Republic, I think it's best if my family assumed direct control over several strategic trade posts currently under... <laughs> you are very persistent. My wife was murdered. Oh, sad times. Uh, we got rid of her just because she was not making babies anymore. Let's search for another young woman. Preferably strong. God, I don't want to look through this big list again. Let's just sort by age and hope that we find someone strong that just turned 17 or 16 or whatever. You know, the more often you search the list, the, the more of a waste of time it really is. 19-year-old quick? I guess that's better than... Now nah, we'll just we'll just go with regular lustful minus touch type approach. More attractive maybe. Uh, this one, Marcos. Uh, yeah, she should be fine. I think on stewardship. Oh God! Look how low my domain limit is. Two. It's it's pretty bad. Take the prestige. Praise God. My income is actually pretty far down. Uh, you want to make me steward, alright? Stop trying to take my damn trade posts. We'll consider it. Okay, unfortunately, no. My wife does not quite have enough stewardship to allow us to have five holdings. Oh, sorry, six holdings. So, do we get rid of one? problem is that we are considered to be baron tier. Or no, we're count tier, so we can have we can have a mayor here. Um I don't know. We can attack a Malfi. Seize trade posts. Does a Malfi have any trade posts that we could use? To connect our, our CC zones. <laughs> what? <laughs> Declare war on a character. If we become independent now, we will become a lesser republic and the game will end. <laughs> That's funny. Why does it even let you do that then? Okay. Um, so we can't actually declare war on any of the other petitions. That makes me sad. I was hoping we could connect our trade posts. Well, I guess it's a Malfi then. I mean, we just... Just seize a trade post from him, whatever we can get our hands on. Something. Let's take the trade post from Rome. I'll find you someone nice, my dear. Who needs commanders? When you have 7,500 archers, you don't need commanders. Come on, there should be a trade post here for us to siege. Why aren't we sieging it? Well... If we can't take advantage of being not the Serene Doge, then there's really no reason to not always be the Serene Doge. Pretty much. And that's just the way that it seems to me. So let's uh let's just build some stuff, you know, whatever. Build build things. Pikemen. We 
We want lots of troops. And then with the rest of our money, we'll probably keep those keep that money available for mercenaries. Being over our domain limit really is uh, unfortunate. Um, I guess I'll just give it away. You surrender. Wonderful. So now we have what, 23? That's so silly. Like, um, so we, we can't do anything against other people in our own republic, but we can easily, freely go over the trade post limit. No problem whatsoever if we attack other republics. Awesome. I'm about to kill you. No. If we attack Rome, let's totally attack the Pope. We're gonna attack the Pope. Oh, the Pope has quite a few men. <laughs> okay. <laughs> of course he does. What was I thinking? I know what I was thinking. I was thinking this seems like a great idea. <laughs> Let's do it. Um, well, we have some money. Like I said, let's hire some mercenaries and go attack the Pope. Uh, we'll hire, say, you and you. So all, all of our archers will help out tremendously when it comes to winning the battle. But we do need some, some meat to the, to the army so that once the battle actually starts, we don't fold. And I think we're going to just get rid of this, uh, one, of, one of these, I don't know. I, I should get rid of one of the towns. I really don't want to, though. Okay, Pope. You you can't have money. It's my money. I want to vassalize the Pope. We can't, of course, but... We're going to take his city. Give me your city. It's my city. Oh, we don't want those. Oh, God, somebody's sieging me with, like, eight, eight troops. So, yeah. How do you like me now, Mr. Popey Man? I don't know why I'm picking a fight with the Pope. He's just next to me. If he wasn't next to me, I'd be a, a perfectly good Catholic, and I would leave him alone, but... You know. He had the poor fortune to be my next-door neighbor. Republics just have that much power. So, yeah, we'll take that city, please. Thank you. So yeah, the Pope's probably going to be a little bit upset about me doing that. Uh, we'll probably be wise to improve relations with the Pope. Sorry about that, old man. And how many troops does Lothringi have? Because we have 12,000 handy. Why don't we just declare war on him? We could probably take him. We are losing money right now. What about the Byzantine Emperor? He's got 10,000. He'll probably siege those, which would, ironically, ironically, by sieging these, he hurts the loot bar, which actually reduces his own income, <laughs> which is pretty funny. Seize the city. Oh, yeah, seize those cities. I want to seize that city. There's so many freaking cities in that province. Are there really four cities here? One, two, three, four. Oh my god, there are. I want them all. We should try to expand into Constantinople. Which one of these cities makes the most money? 41, 36, 41, 36. I want Galata. The question is just, can we actually kill, can we take the Byzantine Emperor right now? 
If we put our army in Mesembria and then declare war, I think yes. I think we could. Uh, oh. Never mind. They sieged something and now I have no boats. What's happening here? Sicilian count County War for Count Ioni's claim on Messina. So the city of Messina is one war, and then Croatia is attacking our our liege for our city. All right, so we've got our own problems to deal with for now. Stop sieging my stuff. I know Croatia wants this land, but it's mine. Jerk. I guess we're going to go around the long way as well. Let's get rid of the mercenaries. We're not going to be doing anything interesting soon. Stop sieging my city, though. Seriously. And where is Venice? Why? I mean, if you're not even going to... My fierce rival has also become a follower of the new way of Christ. Hallelujah. Okay, whatever. Start a faction. Independence faction. That's, again, strange. Why would it even be in the list? And I am the next expected successor, so we could just try to kill the current one. There doesn't seem to be anything interesting about being the weak person now. How disappointing. Oh, it's my own daughter. Um... Let's get her married, because we can get some prestige out of it. 200 for that. Or... four hundred for a king. Yes, please. Cha-ching! Give me some prestige. And my niece. Just marry both my. <laughs> you look the exact same guy. <laughs> it's like just married two of my women. Whatever. Um, and then why are we at seven out of five now? All oh, right. I knew that. I took a city. Of course, I knew that. Okay. We've we've got to get rid of some of these holdings. I, I'm I'm feeling more like this is appropriate than this. So let's uh, turn that into a vassal. And let's turn this one into a vassal as well. And they should stay my vassals. So that's good. Alright, I'm going to take a break here. Thank you for watching, everyone. See you again soon.